Hi, Cocktail Connoisseur. My name is Facundo Gallegos. I'm the bar manager of the St. Regis Venice, and I welcome you today to the Arts Bar. Today I'm going to present you our signature cocktail, which is the twist on the Bloody Mary. As you probably know, the Bloody Mary was uh, created at the St. Regis, New York in 1934 by the head bartender uh, named Fernand Petiot. So each hotel of uh, our company, we have our own version. Uh, in this case, our motto is to create something avant-garde, so, uh, to shake tradition. So today I'm going to present you the Santa Maria Bloody Mary. Santa Maria Bloody Mary is inspired by a local ingredient as well, which is the grape. And uh, we are using two key ingredients. So I will start preparing the drink for you. Uh, the first ingredient will be our verjuice. So we have uh, 15 milliliters of verjuice. Verjuice uh, is the, an unripe grape juice that uh, stays for the lemon juice for the classic Bloody Mary. So we kept the DNA of the Bloody Mary uh, that at the origin was called the Red Snapper. And uh, it's vodka base. Uh, the vodka we use is uh, vodka infused with uh, horse radish and we're using uh, 50, 40 milliliters. The main thing of our uh, Bloody Mary is the clarified tomato juice. So we clarify the tomato juice with the agar agar. And uh, I will uh, add uh, 75 milliliters. There we are. For the spiciness, we use a, a spicy tincture, homemade. Uh, again, keeping the DNA of the classic red snapper for the St. Regis. Uh, we have the spicy tincture made with uh, cayenne pepper and black pepper. So we'll add three brushes. Last but not least is three drops of salt solution to recall the city of Venice. And as well, three dashes. All right, so the method we use is uh, throwing. So I will throw the cocktail a few times in order to oxygen the cocktail. There we are. And cocktail is almost ready. For the ice, we use a, a little clear ice block that you can see here with our logo of the St. Regis Venice. There we are. And the last touch, as I mentioned, the grape, we use some grappa spray on top. As a garnish, we have uh, our homemade crisp made with tomato and celery, slightly spicy. And here we have the Santa Maria Bloody Mary. Santa Maria Bloody Mary, because it's inspired by the church we have in front of the hotel, which is called Basilica di Santa Maria della Salute. And that's why the glass represents as well the dome of the church. Salute. Grazie.